At New Mexico State University, every building has a story, and among them, Thomas and Brown Hall stands out. Not just as a structure of brick and mortar, but as a cornerstone of the university's engineering legacy. For decades, it has been more than just a place of learning. It's been a birthplace of innovation and the continuing of a student-centric tradition. The roots of Thomas and Brown Hall trace back to a time when NMSU was rapidly expanding its academic programs to meet the needs of a growing nation. Engineering was at the forefront of this expansion. In 1971, the building was constructed for electrical engineering and was named after two pioneering figures in NMSU's history, Melvin A. Thomas and Harold Brown. Thomas joined NMSU in 1931 as an electrical engineering professor. He then became dean in 1947. Brown joined NMSU in 1937, taking over as the electrical engineering department head in 1956. He was revered for his dedication to supporting students. The building was originally named Thomas Brown Hall. However, to avoid confusion and provide clarification, the name was changed to Thomas and Brown Hall. This building was dedicated to providing state-of-the-art facilities for the study of electrical and computer engineering. Over the decades, Thomas and Brown Hall has undergone numerous renovations and upgrades, ensuring that it remains a cutting-edge facility for the future generations of engineers. The building's last semester was spring 2024, and over the summer, work began to relocate faculty, staff, laboratories, and hardware. From its humble beginnings to its role last semester as a hub of learning and research, Thomas and Brown Hall represents the enduring legacy of those who built NMSU's engineering program. It stands as a beacon of knowledge, preparing students to tackle the challenges of tomorrow. As the sun sets over campus, Thomas and Brown Hall remains a symbol of the past, present, and future of engineering at New Mexico State University, a place where student-centric tradition meets innovation.